Well, I'm thinking ve a vector man. What? Vectrix? Vex? Vectrix? No, 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 no. What? Forty-seven dollars for Prime. Not worth it. Comes, comes with Alan Wake and all, all DLC. I want to not suggest getting that. Um, generally speaking, if if, uh, if any, because like Quantum Break sounds like a triple A title. Like that's not worth getting. Um, why did you? Def it doesn't even like let me confirm. Like I just wanted to confirm. Like so, I didn't want to defend with her. Also, at a certain point, you can't actually like skip it. Crap, ah, dude, this is bad. Oh man. What? Oh, I got poisoned. Oh, you want Quantum Break? Oh. Well, then you can get it then. Like, it's not really that hard. I don't know, decent game at most. <laughs> Freaking jerk. Could you not? Like, honestly. Everyone's so, like, low! This is so annoying. So I only have so much I could do. Ah, crap, dude. Like, I am not in the payroll position. All HP for one ally. Gosh dang it. Let's try this! Oh, you're just asking if Alan Wake is good. Y yes. Sure. Whatever. I just know it's not great. I'll tell you that much. It's it's never been on someone's great list. It's been on someone's like, yeah, this is a pretty fun game type list. But everything else, I don't know. Please stop hurting me. I don't need this in my life. I really don't. Uh. Alpha Storm. And. We have that as. Pretty sure she needs to be healed too. Back off! Alpha Storm! Only one, really? <sighs> Let's try this! Uh... Why, game? Why? Really now? You, you gotta do it this way. Man? Wait, I wanna see if Battle's a slog right now, but oh my goodness gracious. So I wish I got supplies. Cause think things are not looking, looking good right now. Ah, crap. Oh yeah, I've never done this before. It's really cool looking. Oh nice! Jeez Louise, I killed him. Oh wow! A lot of counterattacking in this round. A lot of also Fina getting hurt this round. Like, come on! Could you please stop attacking Fina? Like, honestly? Uh, I might as well. Oh, yeah, you can't. At a certain point, you just cannot stop it. You have, you have to just accept it. It's kind of weird when you think about it. It's like, why, why have it like that? Where I just can't stop it sometimes. Let's try this. Right, so I'm at a decent level health. Good. Stop attacking her! Come on! That's not cool. Snail bra. What is up with your body just like whenever your body like needs just like 
like sit down and rest or something, it just will not. There are other things that will happen with it consistently throughout the entire time. It just like oh, everything's gonna start to itch. Uh, you're gonna want to pick your nose. You're gonna want to like like cough and hack and wheeze. Like I just cannot just just rest. My body needs to do something. It needs to be in action and just like please, I just sit down and stream. Jeez, that's forever. Right there. Where's what the heck? So Despite my yawning and whatnot, I'm not actually bored of this game. I just I don't know what to really say or or, or think right now. I'm just trying to like freaking ugh. So today I'm supposed to be like like going to watch Deadpool and stuff like that, and I've always been mildly surprised with Deadpool. I I've never been particularly fan of Deadpool. He definitely seems to me like the kind of person that is one note, which is like odd, because if anything is anything but when it comes to like actually addressing audiences and and all this and that, but he just seems like that kind of weird-esque Mary Sue character, where he's like, oh I can do all this and that, and like I also like can talk to like everybody else, so I'm like super cool and everything, like everyone liked me, and I just never particularly liked him for that fact, I guess. He, doesn't really, he just doesn't really seem that good of a character. Like, he just says a bunch of, like, comedic one-liners and whatnot, and, well, that's, that's fine and dandy and everything. Uh, maintenance armor. Let's, let's see here. Did I get two of them, or did I? Let's, let's equip. Let's, let's equip. Oh, yes, please. Jeez, I need that. I can't go back. Okay, so can I go through here? Activate, there we go. That's what I needed to do. So yeah, I was supposed to go this way. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So now I can go back and do whatever. Oh, nice. Nice, that's nice. Ooh, magic dude. I don't know what magic dude does. Okay, so then I go down there. Let's get this first. Magic droplet. Ooh, nice. Looks like there's a couple other things. appear to be anything else that I could do here. Huh. So is that it? Oh no, I can go down too, okay. Alright then. So there's like three three parts to it. Dawkins armor, that's good. Let's give that Vice will probably be able to use it better than anybody else. See here. Well, raise attack power and will. Okay. Durable. And glider. See if we could wear that armor that I just 
a sawtooth. Victory armor. That's not really worth it. Alright, whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Daniel Wayne's Deadpool is awful, though. I don't know who Daniel Wayne's De Daniel Wayne is or their Deadpool. Like, a as I mentioned before, like I just never really particularly liked Deadpool. I, I don't know what it is exactly, because like by all all rights and everything, I probably should like him. And I feel like I'm kind of missing something about liking him, because I'm not super hyped for the movie. I I'm like kind of bleh about it. And, uh, there just really isn't much for me to go like, Yeah, woo, Deadpool! This is gonna be super funny, hilarious! Cause, like, in Marvel vs. Capcom 3, I, I didn't even like him. Cause he goes like, Chikachanga! And like, you press the wrong button! And it's like, they're funny the first time you hear it, but over and over and over again. Eh. Oh, he's the current author of Deadpool. The older Deadpool was uh, much better. I can see that. Like, I guess what what I, I really don't like a dead, about Deadpool is uh, how he's particularly like like people see him more as wacky than as like an actual person that's just like he straight up because the way that I hear Deadpool's lore excites me. I, I, that's what I like about Deadpool. I don't like that he says like these random references and he does these random things uh, and he like talks to the audience that way. The thing that I like about Deadpool is that. He's this kind of person that just, uh, has generally gone crazy throughout the years and just kind of worked with it. Uh, he, he's a better person for it, and, like, he used to be abused all the time. Uh, and he just, like, there's more to the character, you know, than just, like, some sort of, like, like, oh, I'm super wacky, crazy, fun time. And no one really gives him the time of day for that. At least, like... Like, when they market him that way, it's just like, you know, a difference. So, it's, de it's definitely something that is a hiccup of mine that I, d I don't like. And, uh, whenever I see Deadpool market, I guess that's what it is. I think that's exactly why I don't, I'm don't. i not particularly a, a fan of right now, currently, of, of the Deadpool that I'm seeing. It's because it's being marketed to me. Um, and I don't... I never really liked Deadpool being marketed to me. Uh, he, I don't feel he's good at marketing as he is just like as a person. It's like kind of like Dane Cook in a lot of ways where people kind of force Dane Cook on you, but like if you'd actually made the person in real life, he's actually pretty okay. So it's I guess it's one of those things that's like, oh you're gonna like him, you're gonna like him, you're gonna like him, you're gonna like him. And like that's not cool. Like don't don't force your agenda on me, you know. So I guess that's what I I don't particularly like, I care for or like Deadpool. But largely, like oh yeah, current Deadpool's oh, this, this is Looney Tune. Uh, older Deadpool is insane. Uh, does jokes and he doesn't do all the fourth uh, fourth wall breaking memes. Yeah, I definitely have to say that's that's what I don't like. But uh, like. That's pretty cool how Deadpool is kind of like bisexual, pansexual, or whatever jazz he is. Uh, and how Ryan Reynolds is all like, I would like Deadpool to have a boyfriend in the next one. That's super cool. Like, yeah, nice, good job. Uh, one room for the gift for type, Dilly. But, eh, it just... Like, I'm probably going to miss it, honestly. When, when This is what I'm trying to get at. I'm probably going to miss watching Deadpool with my friends, and while I particularly miss, like, hanging out with my friends, I don't particularly don't mind missing the movie Deadpool. Uh, he's a chubby chaser. <laughs> oh my goodness. I can totally see that. Oh, it's a little star now. Okay. Uh, but, how to say... What was, what was it? Just, just kind of like, beh. Like, I'd rather get work done, is, is in a lot of ways in regards of why, what I feel about this. Like, I'd rather get my work done than uh, be able to see Deadpool. And uh, a lot of people, they don't, like, I know I mentioned this quite a few times, but it's really, this you got to treat it like a job. 
gotta treat what you love like a job if you want to keep doing it, because, like, if you don't, then people are not also going to. And, uh, I, I, like, I'm essentially just editing. That's, that's what I'm doing. I'm gonna be editing, and I'm gonna be, uh, just kind of, uh, like, looking at what, what does what, and what I could do. And, uh, I have a deadline. I actually have a deadline of Valentine's Day is, uh, my anniversary, and... I really, really want to get get that in order to like have a video out by then. Will it actually happen? I don't know. Maybe I'll just meet at the very end at like midnight. I don't know, but I I would I would hope so to at least do that much because I would like to have Valentine's Day as my anniversary because that's exactly when the first uh, video of mine when it comes to uh, L let's playing uh, aired. It aired on what on the Valentine's Day. And that was uh, Beyond Good and uh, Beyond Good and Evil. And I just like find that like super cool that that's when I started. It was speaking on Valentine's Day. And I, I looked at the old video that I had there for Beyond Good and Evil. And, oh my God, it's like so much worse than what I have right now. And I'm probably gonna look back at this and go like, Oh my God, this is so much worse than what I have now. And it's really funny to like look back on yourself and see what worked for you, what didn't work for you, and just how you evolved as a person it's it's so weird that's kind of like the beauty of uh of uh like recording yourself you just get this kind of way oh, freaking which which way do you want me to go okay there we go so like, i i couldn't tell you like what exactly i was doing in my life when i was recording uh that let's play of uh, Beyond Good and Evil, but I, I can tell you for sure that like, uh, like I, I feel it in my soul like how much I actually really love to do everything that I did uh, in that thing, and it just I did not have the recording process that I have now, and it's kind of ridiculous because I never thought I would get to this this area I would say uh, where where, I, where I'm at, and it just it's so cool, dude. It's so cool uh, to to see that. What, what are you doing? TL put like a little link. Okay, oh, a uh, Street Fighter. Okay. Uh, street, street Fighter... Street Fighter 5, oddly enough, I haven't been too excited about. Eh, just... Bleh. And the weird thing is too is that it has like several characters that I really like. Uh, Karen is one of my favorite characters in Street Fighter. Um, I love her a whole bunch because she's super gay, and uh, she's just like have this this weird sort of like like I'm a rival to you, Sakura, and Sakura's just kind of like what? What are you talking about? It just it's so funny to me <laughs> that Sakura does not treat her like a rival whatsoever, and uh, no one treats her like a rival to Sakura, and it's so hilarious to me that that that's the case, because uh, uh, Karen's like can train me, and like Ken's like no, I'm not going to train you. Uh, <laughs> and freaking <laughs> like just talks to like Sakura like like I don't like you like like why are you always so happy go lucky and want to train all the time and she's just kind of like I like training <laughs> like there's there's so much to the Street Fighter lore that I that I hate because it's not really used and it's like why isn't it used it's it, the Street Fighter lore is actually really good like it's it's actual good story. Uh, but it's not used whatsoever, and people go like, "Oh yeah, fighting games. They don't, they don't, they don't have story." Like, nah, man, nah. Street Fighter has a lot of lore. It's it's pretty ridiculous how much lore Street Fighter has. That's like not even used. Uh, Ken in particular, he actually has a really good backstory, and he was originally going to be like this super serious person. And if you actually look at the way that he used to be, he was he actually was serious. He was a serious person, uh, played as a joke. He played as a joke. Now he is more of a serious spider, but but plays as a joke, uh, but is a joke character, which is like weird, right? Because in Street Fighter 4, he's actually viable to use. Like he can use him, and I'm actually able to use him against a couple of my friends, and like I could beat them, and it sucks for them. <laughs> Why not wait for Super Street, uh, Super Ultra Street Fighter 5 uh, Turbo Anniversary X EX Plus Alpha? Uh, a match of the millennia <laughs> game of the year edition. You know it's coming. You're not wrong. 
You're not wrong. I'll tell you that much. You're not wrong. Get out of here. There we go. It's gonna kind of hold on a second. Oh, like all in a day's work. Sure, buddy. Doing that day. We're doing it just fine. Doing a holiday. Okay, I didn't need to go that way, I guess. Oh, what's it? Oh, there. No! Dang it. So it won't let me use it. Okay, upward. It's like right there! Come on! Oh my god, the angle is terrible on this. It's one of the worst angles ever! Why?! Get it somewhere else. Come on, what the? I'll just try somewhere else, I guess. It's just, it's not gonna happen. Fine. I had no idea why, but like, for some reason, my stream is just like, oh yeah, you're offline. Like, I don't get that. What the heck? It's the thing that's just wrong with Twitch or something, or what? Because, like, consistently throughout, it just says offline. That's all it says. I don't get this. I'm just gonna check it really quick. No, right here. It's just, it's just me. That's all it really is. It's, it's just the way that it says it. I don't, I don't see how many people I actually have on, on my thing. Do I have it on my gear list at least? Do I have it? I have a little thing on my gear list. Come on. Yeah, it's not available. Figures. Thanks a lot. Thank, 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 thanks a lot. Ha. Jeez Louise, man. Ha. Get out of here. Get out of here. Die. Ha. Still, really? Take that. Equipment has to check it for me. It's just showing me all the moderators. Just mods. That's all it is. All mods all the time. My goodness gracious. That was a tough fight. Kind of wish my, my thing didn't look that way. No. <laughs> what do you mean no? Let's see here. Gotta heal up. Heal up, heal up, all the honkies heal up. No, I don't want all allies, I just want some allies. That's fine, 500's fine. That's good for now. Turbo Nightbot! <laughs> Thank you, Nightbot! <laughs> Is it all here? Can I go this way? It's a weird dungeon that it's done like piece by piece. It really, really is. I really wish more of these characters are actually like like cross over with other like properties and whatnot, because I feel like Ika is kind of like like she's like the only other one that I feel is really worth it. But she feels like an actual character. She she really, really do. Uh, she's the best character, easily. She has a lot of hope and determination. Come on. So. Uh... Okay. Will we eventually be able to see each other? Because it looks like it. I 
guess so. Let's turn it around again. Hopefully everything works out. What other areas do I have to go to? Looks like I turn it three different ways, essentially. It's all four. Okay, so it's just turning all four ways, and that's, that's essentially it. So go this way. There you go. And then, uh... What other ways can I, can I turn here? Oh! Figures. Figures I didn't see this. Oh, cool, 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 cool. So wait, are we close to them and just not super close? Or is it... I guess we're in a, like a totally different area. It just affects both sides? Seems like it. Okay. So I feel like we're gonna like meet up pretty closely. This way. There should be a little thing that I could I could finally get that cham or whatever. Really? Nothing? Can't go that way? Fine. Sure. Can I go down. Okay. Like this is a, this honestly is a pretty cool puzzle. Like you gotta hand it to them for this. Nothing there. And up here. Hopefully everything works out. Maybe they're nah. It can't be. It's about to say what they're upside down. Like nah, they wouldn't do that. Like it just it's a little too weird. This is really odd, odd to figure out. Huh. So you're never quite sure what's gonna work here. Yeah, that works. And, uh. Yeah, I go this way. It's you! Die! Are we gonna see him now? 